Hey folks, welcome back to you watching with the next channel where we teach and explore and discuss about AI technology. So this is Tushar work and we are going to explore on the topic of five most powered AI extensions that can be installed right to your Google Chrome browser and also in another browsers which supports the Chrome extensions. So in this video, I have brought up five AI extension which is actually giving you and enabling you to work more productively well. You don't need to go to that particular AI website and make the task done. So all you have to do is just install that particular AI tool and that's it. 9 rupees. 9 rupees cannot even buy you a packet of chips. But what if I tell you 9 rupees can save your job? What if I tell you 9 rupees can get you salary hike? What if I tell you 9 rupees can build your career in a better way? Sounds too good to be true, right? So the five tools that I have made, uh, you know, the list is ready completely for you to understand. So first tool that we will be using is the Compose AI tool. So all you have to do, like for now, I'm using the Brave browser and let's see whether the Brave browser is supporting the Chrome extensions or not. So this is the one we were talking about, which is the Compose AI, AI powered writing tool. Let's click on it and let's have a look key. How does it works and what are its features? So basically it's an AI powered writing tool. You can obviously, you know, uh, just type slash and you can generate any kind of text it might be a simple text extremely very powerful text what kind of text you want you can do anything and you can reply to emails with a single click generate responses will you know with the reference to the context from the original email and not just that you can also write complete full messages from just a short phrase and you can also auto complete and rephrase like simply type and compose AI will display suggestions highlight text to get new suggestions for wording and lastly it automate your writing with AI let's click on the add to brave okay so Microsoft uh, Bing along with brave also supports supports the Chrome Web Store. I'm in the Chrome extensions. So let's do one thing. Let's open the Gmail account and let's see how does this works. Let's open, you know, any of the mail like Sashwant. I'm sure he is the person. I don't know who is he. Okay. So this is now installed. Click these button, buttons to draft an email with Compose AI. So I would like to say yes, say no, say thanks. Mm, tell Compose AI to what to draft. I would like something key. I thank you for dropping me a mail and I consider, uh, I mean, considering me a right fit for this thing, but right now I'm not interested in this thing. Write this in a polite and decent manner. Let's click on the enter button and let's see how this Compose AI is working. So dear Shashwat Amarev, thank you so much for your email and for including me in the upcoming stock market master class beginner session. I greatly appreciate the opportunity to learn and connect with other individuals who are interested in stock market trading. However, after giving considered thought, I have decided to not participate in the session at this time. So you have seen that how beautifully this AI tool is working. So this was just the first AI tool. Let's go to the second AI tool and let's see how is this working. Let's go back to the Chrome extension and search for the AI tool, which is the wise one. So before moving ahead, I would like to tell you one thing that if you are someone who is not using the AI technology, then you are putting your job at risk. Why am I saying you this? Because AI is not going to replace any human being. But yes, a person using AI can replace another person. So do understand in the 2023 era, you have to get adapted with the AI technology because it is the new revolutionary futuristic way of working. Please do understand that AI is not replacing anybody. But yes, it is a new way of working in 2023 and this is the futuristic model of working it actually helps you to enhance your work experience it reduces your time and it actually helps you to be more productive and more creative so if you really want to get adaptive the AI technology then i am here to let you know that this is a workshop link that i have opened in my screen bar which is happening just for 9 rupees do understand i am not here to sell this workshop it is a beneficial offer for you this is a workshop which will be done with the help of two iit kharagpur alumni who have co-founded multiple seven figure companies and they by themselves are going to teach you how to get adaptive with the ai technology and not just this you'll also be getting a certificate at the end of the course the link is given in the description below do check it out and get promoted get updated be updated and be more knowledgeable in the ai industry so now let's get back to the video wise one is your ai powered reading tool so what does it does it diverse and discover your perspectives from reliable sources and when i come back here uh it simplifies the most complex information and it saves you hours of reading time and enhance your productivity okay it depends on understanding on any topic on the web okay sounds good and uh, it is the same okay let's click on add to brave let's click on add the extension button let's see how is this working let's click on continue with google let's get logged in here and let's confirm on this thing and let's see how is this working so we have installed wise one now successfully uh uh, let's open I would open DNA website because I usually am you know using this DNA platform for getting the tech news all these things so I'll click here let's go down I'll open any of the articles so this is 
the article that I have open. I'll click on the extension button. Let's click on the pin button. I'll click on this and I can, you know, do any of the thing like uh, instead of I'll click on language change to English, summarize, ask anything, explore. Like here, I click on the ask, uh, you know, a uh, question. Like, do I want to ask any question with this article or on the internet? Like, I'll click on this article and uh, and I like key. What is this exactly? Can you please explain me in a shorter way? This article is about the history of Supreme Yacht and which is considered the most expensive. Okay. And if I just go back, I'll click on summarize. Let's click on summarize button and you'll see that this article is now getting summarized in a very simple way with the help of this AI tool. So this is the summarized version. And also you can obviously go and click on explore button and you know, you can see a lot of uh, the relatable articles like this was the DNS. Also the Irish Sun has uploaded the same article, the Amazon. If you just click on this, you can see that this same article from a different website is also uploaded here. You can obviously go and check it out and you can find that very easily with the help of this AI tool. This was all about the wise one. Let's go back and let's see the now the Merlin AI tool. Let's go back to the Chrome extension. Let's click on Merlin. Click here. One click access to powerful AI plugins. Click on this add to brave button. Click on the AI extension. In the meantime, what is it? Okay, so Merlin is uh, a kind of chat GPT which works on your search engine and uh, it also helps you to summarize your YouTube videos and not just that, it also works on the Gmail. It also works as a chatbot on every website and it is completely GPT-4 with free, uh, you know, and also supports web access. So all I have to do is click on the extension button, click on Merlin and click on the spin button and now I'll open google.com. Now let's search for how to find the best uh, tools for my works. Let's search and you can see that also Vice One is working here and also the Merlin is working up here. Like Merlin is replying me that there are several ways to find the best AI tools for your works. One option is to research and compare various AI tools or uh, looking at factors such as features, user reviews and pricing. So I like to click on the start feature. Okay, let's click on the sign in button. I just have to click here and get signed in here for the very first time only. And then I don't need to do that again and again because once I logged in, I can start chatting it with this chatbot and do that continuously. Okay, so I have credits. What can I ask? Uh, I can ask any of the thing. Like, uh, I'll ask the same too for my works. I make, I do video shooting, video editing, and also writing up the scripts for the video. You can see that if just in the Google search bar, in the Google search results, it is now enabled and it started giving me good AI tools like research AI tools, read, reviews, and comparison, and a lot of more information. Access web. When you click on this option, access web, GPT-4. Also, you have Claude, this Llama, uh, and Merlin and all those things you have here. This is the best way to actually, you know, uh, search for any of the information without going to ChatGPT and that to write from your Google search engine. Let's click on any of the button and let's see how do we, you know, summarize any of the video. I'll click here. I'll go to TechWiser. I'll click here. Okay. So I'll either click uh, summarize this or I'll click on get transcript. First, let's click on the summarize this video. Okay. So it has now summarized me the complete entire video. So this is the main, you know, title like uh, consider refurbished MacBook for budget computing. When I click on the Pan button, it will obviously, you know, give me the detailed, you know, the conversation that has been done in this video. Let's click on the transcript button and you can see that when I click on the get transcript, the entire video transcription will be done within few seconds. Like, yo, it is now complete. And also you have create tweet blogs. When I just click on it, uh, generate tweet from this video, generate tweet thread from this video, generate post from this video for LinkedIn. Uh, like I'll click on this generate post from this video on LinkedIn, creating a LinkedIn post for this video, bought a MacBook under 25,000 on YouTube. It would take some time. Meanwhile, okay, are you searching for a budget friendly computing solution consider my recent purchase of MacBook under 25,000 IANA. So this is the LinkedIn post which you can also create right from your YouTube video. So this was the best thing I think the Merlin is giving us. And the same thing also does uh, when it comes to YouTube titles. Let's click on it and let's get it open. Okay, so this is the YouTube Digest summarized using chat GPT. What it does, let's open the video and you will have a better idea about this. Okay, so we can just click on the chat GPT summary and you can see that it will automatically summarize the entire video and give us the result within few seconds. So this is what the YouTube Digest AI Chrome extension is prom promising us. Also, we can save it in the form of PDF or in document format or in any of the thing. Also, we can, you know, uh, go to the settings bar and make any kind of changes. Like if you want, you can add some bullet points, maximum number of bullet points you want, the summarized language you can choose and also a lot of things. And you can also select the theme and the trigger move. A lot of things can be done over with this AI tool. Okay. So also Merlin does the same thing, but uh, this is 
a tool which specifically does only this thing, uh, which is, you know, uh, the AI, I mean, the video summarization. Let's get back to the scene. Okay, so come here. Okay, and just because I have uh, not installed yet, let's click on the add to brave. Let's click on extension. YouTube data cell, click on the pin button. I will mute this video for now. Let's click on the summarize button. Okay, so just like every other AI tool, I need to click on the sign in button and need to, you know, get logged in here for the only one time. And then for the rest of the times, I just have to click on the button. So more title section, bullet points. What do I want? So I want a title sections, language I want in English. Okay, let's click on. Okay, I want it in bullet points. Let's click on the summarize button. So, so now it will use chat GPT along with its own, you know, backend server to create the summarized version of this video. And personally, when summarizing the video, I compare it with Mundane. I think this looks quite better because it is specifically working for this thing and it has a very better potential when comparing it with Mundane just for the purpose of YouTube video summarization. If I just click on this thing, so it is now curating the information with this thing, with the video. Let's click on uh, the article and let's click on one more uh, summarize button. Mm. So you can see that with a YouTube video, this YouTube Direct AI Chrome extension is now creating an article. So let's wait for a few seconds and let's get it done and let's see how is this looking. Thought a video faster than Harsh. So now this is done. Let's click on the download button and let's see that in which format is it getting downloaded. I personally like this one. Let's click on the download button once again and let's see is this downloadable or not. Is a refurbished MacBook worth it on a budget? And obviously go and play the audio also if I want. Okay, I don't know what is happening, but I'm not able to download this thing for now. Let's click on the settings button and you can see that what for duration do I need to download. Okay, uh, I export type PDF doc. Okay, it is giving me. So I need to click on the PDF. Let's click on export button. Let's click here. I'll load as a MacBook under 25,000 article. I'll save this in the desktop. I'll open this. Okay, so you can see that this is really looking very cool and very amazing. And without, you know, spending a lot of time, you actually get what this is done with the help of one AI tool. Now, this is the last and the most important AI tool, which is the Max AI. So what it does, let's click on the Max AI and let's click and it is basically the chat GPT, you enable it at every place. So uh, obviously each and every AI tool has its own potential, has its own benefits and its own, you know, kind of advantages. But this is one click chat GPT. You can use this in the email, you can use this in the browser, you can, you know, summarize anything, you can translate anything. And uh, not just that, you can also, you know, kind of reply to any text, you can summarize, you can chat as a chatbot and uh, you can do lots of lots of things with the help of this Max AI tool. Let's click on the continue with Google. Let's get logged in here. Let's close this thing. Let's come back to Google. Let's refresh the page and now search here. So basically this is the Alt plus J. When I just click on Alt plus J, this Max AI gets open. Continue with ChatGPT, Bing Web App, Bart Web App, what kind of... So I'll continue with ChatGPT for now. And you can obviously go and search and type any of the thing. For example, uh, how to get started in the AI industry. I'll search the same thing here and also the same thing over the search bar. So when I search in the Google search bar, even the normal result. So if you're unaware, unaware about how this is coming up, like even the Google bar is enabled in my Google search, you know, bar. There's a video made on this already on the BTNX YouTube channel. Go and check it out so that you can have a better information about how to access this thing. The Google AI in the Google search bar. So when I search for this, you can see that also I'm getting the result in the Google search bar. And in the meantime, I'm also getting the results by the Max AI. So Max AI is giving me the sources and also giving me the exact answer that I was actually looking for. Continue in AI powered source. I'll click on this and you can see that I can actually continue, keep on, you know, asking and keep on continuing this conversation. So this was all about Max AI dude. I hope you found the video useful. If yes, then let me know by giving a thumbs up to this video. And also don't forget to hit that uh, subscribe button and you and do press that bell icon because you will not miss any of the video updates. So this was Tushar Bhakt and you are watching BTNX. Thank you for staying tuned and I'll meet you with one more amazing video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.